talk about giant sheds. For the last two seasons, my dad has been finding sheds from one of the most amazing bucks that I have ever seen. I found this buck down in Arizona. Uh, I found the sets off from him in the previous years. He had eye guards, but now the eye guards have melted off and they've gone to the, to the bladed. This horn here, probably 125 inches, and this horn got broke off. It's almost, looks a lot like this one. It had a drop tine on, plus the regular top that come up. And it was sad when I, <laughs> I found this one first. And then I found this one and I cried <laughs> and came home. But I found them both in the same day. It took me about, oh, two to three hours to find this one. And I found this one in the first hour. They was about 300 yards apart when I finally ended up finding them both. Later repaired, the once in a lifetime find has 10 points per side and a gross score of 266 inches. Talk about great finds. This next clip shows Clay Bundy with a rare find from the Arizona Strip. On our last Mealy Crazy release, I showed you this incredible pair of sheds that my father found on the Kaibab Plateau. This incredible pair of sheds grosses 269 inches, has some of the most amazing points, fins that, have, that has ever been seen. Many people have asked us time and time again uh, if we'd ever found any more sheds from that buck. My dad actually had two years. And then in 2006, a friend of mine, a muley, muley crazy buddy of mine, Landon Whitworth, found another pair of sheds off this, this incredible buck. Landon's awesome pair is 15 by 13 by an estimated 44 inches wide. This incredible pair of sheds is one of the largest ever found in the world. Its uh, SCI score is 306 inches, non-typical. And the amazing thing about this buck is uh, there's five or six recognizable set of sheds that have come off this buck. And since this pair from, this would have been the 05 season, no one's ever seen this buck again. It's amazing that a buck lived and died on the Kaibab Plateau, which is quite heavily hunted, and grew to this immense proportion and was never harvested. But I thought you would enjoy seeing these amazing pair of antlers.